Today our guest is Ian Stewart, who's come along on his day off. Uh, he's the Chief News Director of Auckland and Northland Communities for Fairfax. Yeah, I was a crime reporter at the Christchurch Press uh, for five years. Um, I'm sure you know who this guy is. That's me. <laughs> um, yeah, locally famous for sitting behind David Bain for six weeks. Um, covered lots of nasty crimes in Christchurch. It seemed to be a particularly um, uh, fertile time. At the what we're after in terms of you guys. These are the, uh, the things I was kind of having a chat to the news directors in Auckland about what we're after in journalists. Um, because we see a lot of people coming through that have really good um, technical skills. They might know how to make a video and put it up straight away. They might know how to I don't know, write a nice story and whatever. But these are the things that we kind of identified as a group. Um, these top two, being news hounds and story finders, is, are the main things. Um, I can teach a monkey how to write a news story. Um, they're really easy. Uh, and it's a, just basically a technical skill. It's a trade. Um, you can teach that to anybody. I can teach my mum how to do it. Um, what I can't teach somebody is how to go out and find a story. Um, I can tell you all the different ways that it is done, but in the end of the day, you're going to have to find your own way of finding these stories. Um, the main thing we're looking for in journos is people who can go out, find something that we didn't already know about, and tell it to us. Um, it sounds really, it sounds like a basic uh, concept, but you'd be surprised at how many people walk in first day in the newsroom and you say, all right, what are your ideas for stories? And they've got absolutely no idea. Um, if you ever go into a journalism job interview, make sure you've got at least five story ideas that you can rattle off that are going to excite the person that's interviewing you um, because that's how you're going to get a job. Um, how do you do that? The main thing is being a really good contact builder. Um, and that means you've got to be able to go out there, meet people, uh, become friends with them, talk to them, um, and be able to get them to tell you stuff that possibly they haven't told everybody else, um, stuff that you find interesting. Um, yeah, you've basically got to work it as, as, as a social job in that you have to be able to find people who are going to tell you things that you want to be able to put in the paper. There's a lot of time pressure in journalism these days. You haven't got time to, to mess around. Um, so one of the most challenging things is uh, doing a thorough and accurate job, but also within that kind of limited time frame. In a news meeting, you'll find uh, everyone pitches, it'll be someone's turn to pitch their stories. They'll say three stories, and then they'll say, oh, I've got this other one, I don't really know if it's a story, but I guarantee you that's the story that we want.